Broadstone Station. If you wanted to travel to Galway by train around 1850, you did not go to Houston Station to catch your train. You went to Broadstone Station in Fibsborough instead. At that time, Ireland did not have just one railway company as it now has. There were many different ones. The following four railways operated from Dublin. The Great Northern Railway, GNR, served the north and northeast of the country. The Great Southern and Western Railway, GSWR, the southwest. The Dublin, Wicklow and Wexford Railway, DWWR, the southeast. And the Midland Great Western Railway, MGWR, the Midlands and West. And all these railway lines had their own terminal station. This means the end station. The large granite building at Broadstone was the Dublin terminal of the Midland Great Western Railway Company, MGWR. From here the company ran trains to Galway. The station was opened in 1847 and trains departed from there until 1937. The site for Broadstone station was chosen because it was connected to the Royal Canal by an arm that ran parallel to Fibsborough Road. It also had a harbour where boats could dock and the station was built right opposite. Heavy goods could be brought to the station by the canal and then carried westwards by train. When the Royal Canal arm was filled in in the 1920s and the MGWR joined with other railway companies to form the Great Southern Railway, GSR, in 1924, Broadstone lost its value as a railway station. It finally closed on the 16th of January 1937. The closing ceremony was broadcast live on RT Radio. The first train to the west from Westland Row Station, now Pierce Station, departed on the 18th of January 1937, and Broadstone Station became a garage for buses.